Welcome to Shrimp Coverlet. I am Adrian Fort. And I'm Dalton Gentry. And we're here with uh, an unboxing as well as an announcement. Dalton, tell them what we're announcing. Okay, what so... What we're announcing. What we're announcing. Are you, you're making fun of how I talk now. I'm no, gonna start I'm not. Sa- I'm going to start saying N- announcing. No, I am not. It's just, especially today, I, I hate you so much. I'm having trouble. Okay, so, we've been talking a long time about doing a movie channel. Yes. Uh, and we finally decided to set a date. It's like a wedding. I'm so excited. Yes. Uh, and we have a name, and we're good to go. So this unboxing will be an unboxing of films. Now this is from Vintage Talk. It is twelve ninety nine, and the little label that says Brown Bag Special. <laughs> so if there's no pornography in here, I'm going to be very upset. Uh, so this will be actually linked on our other YouTube channel that will be launching, hopefully today when you're seeing this video. Uh, our movie channel has the best name ever. Yep. We will be calling ourselves the Aristocrats. Yes, yes, we will. Uh, if you get that joke, I like you as a person. Uh, so if you want to go over onto Twitter, you can follow us at Aristocrat Show. Both of these things will be linked in the description below. I'll link below. And also, please go over to the Aristocrats Movie Review Channel. Hit subscribe, and hopefully early November, yeah, uh, you're going to be flooded with content. Yeah. So, let's unbox these movies. You're the one with fingernails. Go ahead. <laughs> That's actually terrifically true. Look at that. Look at that. That's you bite your nails, don't you? I devour them. That's disgusting. Where get my fiber? There's tape on this. I I don't like tape. I need here. Come here. I got keys. Jesus Christ, vintage stock. I got keys. Well, now I've accepted the challenge. Okay. So, fifteen bargain brown bag special movies. No idea what's in here. I actually asked the guy who sold it to us. I'm like, these are terrible, aren't they? He's like, I don't know. I didn't stock them. I'm like, just tell me they're terrible. Come on, baby, just Dallas. Number one, Lady Frankenstein. <laughs> oh, that looks awful. Uh, when is this? This must be from the 70s. 1972, Lady Frankenstein. Rated R. There you go. Uh, that is that is like C grade horror. Only the monster she made could satisfy her strange desires. It is porn! Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> That's awesome. Holy moly. Uh, now, so, are, are, we're, are we reviewing all of these films on The Aristocrats? Um, I am not sure. We, we should at least get a, a small review on all of them. Yes. Uh, so, these will pop up from time yeah. to time, but uh, we'll see. You ready for the next one? <laughs> not yet. I gotta get over this first, man. <laughs> That's a good start. Yeah. Uh, who's in it? Is anybody worth uh, it? <laughs> Joseph Cotton is the lead bill, so no. Okay. Next up. L.A. Dix. Well. Agency. Two for two. Oh, this comes from Blockbuster. <laughs> All right. Hilarious. A refreshingly well-written black comedy from the Hollywood North Report. Uh, welcome to the strange underground world of Los Angeles private dicks. Based on real-life subculture of L.A. detectives who pitch their actual cases to Hollywood. Michael Madsen? Oh, my. That's, uh... We got a bunch of winners here. Let me peel this label off so we can see who's actually in it. That's Michael Madsen. I don't know who that is. Uh, Reservoir Dogs? Uh, I've never seen that. Never seen Reservoir Dogs? No, should I have? Yeah, probably. Okay, that is literally under the saran wrap, so that is not coming off. It's fine. Okay. Uh, Never heard of it. Yeah, that is from 2007. Okay. Well, winner, winner, chicken dinner. I'm sure it was a blockbuster. All right. Next up. Land of the Blind. What? So that person looks very familiar. Yes. Is that Ray Fiennes? Uh, that is Ralph Fiennes. Is that his name? It's Rafe, I'm pretty sure. I don't think there's an L in there. <laughs> they probably mistyped it. That's Voldemort. No, no. Uh, that Ray is. Fiennes? I'm. He might be. I don't know. That's Voldemort. I'm not Is this that guy? Yes. Oh, I'm talking about the older guy. That's oh. he plays in the Hunger Games. Oh, yeah. No, that's not Ray Fiennes. Okay. That's Donald Sutherland. What do we know about it? Um, nothing. This, <laughs> um, Academy Award nominee Ralph Fiennes, the English patient, and Donald Sutherland give electrifying performances in this taut and gripping thriller. A government agent is on a mission to subdue terrorists and overthrow a corrupt regime. It's a timely film about revolution, romance, and betrayal. Also starring Lyra Flynn Boyle. What? <laughs> he just threw that in at the end? She must have gotten big after the movie was made. Yes. And this was already written. Okay. Yeah. Uh, so that one actually might be tolerable. Uh, let's move on. Okay. Next up. All right. Uh, shoot or be shot. Never mind. I gave up saying tolerable. 
Uh, in this hilarious offbeat comedy in the tradition of Bowfinger, William Shatner stars as Harvey Wilkes, a mental ward escapee with a script he'd really love to see made. We got a Shatner film in here. Yeah. That's amazing. Not just a Shatner film. When is, this is from 2004. So this is like the gray period of Shatner. <laughs> where he went from being not a... From being, he w- became legend, disappeared, and then became internet legend, right? Okay. So, so this, this is during the gray period. This is during the... The non-Shatner years. Okay. Uh, at least we have a recognizable name. But, uh... Yeah. I'd also like to point out these are all, like, dollar specials at the vintage stock. Yeah. So, they were, were actually like, coming out ahead. 15 for, for $13. Yeah, they're like, we'll, we'll knock off two bucks if you just take them. <laughs> just take them. All right. Uh, WrestleManiac. Let the face-off begin. Uh, That's okay. up your alley, isn't it? Uh... Kick ass from Fangoria. Fantastic from Film Threat. Uh, for an anim, <laughs> we won. What? We accomplished our mission. Porn. For an amateur porn film crew traveling through Mexico, a wrong turn in the middle of nowhere leads to the ghost town of La Sangre de Dios, where locals claim that the deranged luchador El Mascadoro, <laughs> pro wrestler legend Rey Mysterio, what? still lives to rip off the faces of his victims. This is Rey Mysterio in an off-brand horror with porn elements. Oh, yes. Yes. Uh, actually, everybody else in the channel, because there will be other people on the Aristocrat show, by the way, they're going to be really excited about that. This one's going to be one we're going to end up reviewing. You're going to have to sit through it. I'm sorry. I'll watch it. Like, it's going to be That's democracy fine. against you there, three on one. Yeah. Okay. Did you just roll the R on your three? Three on one. Three. Three. Lake City with Sissy Spacek. 92 minutes of marveling mayhem and acting from Films in Review. Sissy Spacek, uh, Rebecca... Where are you at? Rebecca Romaine. Is that how she spells Romaine? Yeah. I'm terrible at this. Uh, when Billy gets into trouble... How the, the hell do I dealer. know more actors than you? I don't know. I'm not a big film person. Like, I have this select group of films that I could tell you all about. Don't, I haven't watched a DVD in four years. <laughs> <laughs> but uh, when it comes to actors, I can't name any of them. I'm terrible at it. Uh, I- anything that you know about this? No. Uh, nail-biting suspense? Nope. Lake City? Nope. All right. It'll forever remain in suspense. Nope. All right. <clears throat> Are we done yet? This is uh, the Hugh Grant, The Lady and the Highwayman. It's a Hugh Grant collection. I don't have anything to say about that. Get this off my seat. <laughs> uh, the Flying Assassin. Why are you screaming? I don't know. That's exciting. Uh, Beyond the Mask of Hayabusa. That's exciting. That's another wrestling film. So wrestling and pornography, that's that's what you get in these bags, I guess. In the earlier battle, Mr. Gunosuke Broke Hayabusa, stripping him of his mask and identity. This is literally not a movie. This is wrestling videos. <laughs> this is <laughs> It's a best of. It's a best of wrestling videos. Okay, of Hayabuka, ha- ha- Hayabusha. The Flying Assassin. The Flying Assassin. This is going terrible. <laughs> Yeah, this is not going well. This is like worse than our mystery brown bag of books where we're like, oh, true crime, yay. At least people enjoyed that. I don't see anyone in, anyone enjoying this. You want to draw a couple of these? Should we mix uh, it up here? Maybe I've got a... Maybe, I've got maybe better you're luck. better. Maybe you're lucky. Got better luck. All right. There are... We're pulling three out. There's still a thousand movies in here. Lassie. Like the original Lassie? The original Lassie. Okay, that's a classic. That's, that's worth a uh, damn. The Laramie Project. Okay. Oh, there my. was there was uh, uproar around my high school because the Phelps family was going to uh, pick at my high school. I think they had a, a showing or a, a show of that. Okay. The last day of summer. I think we've all been there, right? <laughs> um, this does not look like a movie. This looks like an episode of a television show from 2007, but I'm guessing it's a movie. This is going terrible. Uh, no, no, it just got worse. How's this that? is not the original Lassie. This is like three sub Lassie films. Oh. Lassie's Gift of Love, part oh, one and part two, and The Greatest Gift, featuring Lassie. So that's awful. But the Laramie Project, that's actually a gem. Uh, 2002 Sundance Film Festival. Yeah. Uh, have you seen the play? No. Uh, I've seen the play. It's a wonderful play. Yeah. Uh, so that I'm actually excited about that. Okay. Well, so, we'll do a full review on that. I'm okay somehow. with this. Okay, so now we have 
Uh, Tom Arnold and Bai Ling's Knockdown. Well, I'm going to let you... That looks like more pornography. Uh, Michael Madsen again in LAPD to protect and serve. Uh, Anthony Lapalagia, La Lapalia mm -hmm. in Lantana. Uh, first of all, I'd like what to point you know out... About uh, I, this has a picture of Tom Arnold holding a gun... Which might which be the most that? unnatural oh, thing ever. Yeah. This is knockdown. Yeah. But like the little cutout, all you can see is the exotic and addictive spell of a prostitute. Well. So <laughs> I don't know if this actually contains knockout uh, in the slip cover. So surprise there. All right. Well. Uh, oh my. <laughs> this is going fantastic so far. The Jackie Robinson story. Okay, that's something you might know. It something even says about. okay on the cover. <laughs> <laughs> Look, his film that's... was okay. It was all right. Okay. Uh, historical, possibly. Yeah. That's uh, gonna. Yeah. Okay. Okay. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I have nothing uh, to say. Heart of Dixie. Virginia Madsen. This next one's totally getting reviewed. Oh, Wub Idol. All day. Wub Star Idol. That's Wow Wow Wubsy. I have no idea what that means. I've heard the ter the term before. I have nieces. Uh, featuring the voice of Beyonce. Okay, we're so, just gonna get, we're gonna get through this. Now. No, I think this needs to be our first review for the channel. We're gonna get It'll through be the this. greatest thing ever. Last three movies, we've got The Wind in the Willows. Okay, there's literary things there. The Wind in the Willows. If it's not broken. We've got the Kovac box. I know nothing about it. Is that not is that not uh, Kevin Bacon? Uh, Timothy Hutton. Nope, that is not Kevin Bacon. And finally, oh, Kung Fu Shadow. No. <laughs> oh, oh, I'm going to tell you this story now uh, just because uh, I watched Bloodsport last night. Really? Have Blood you ever seen it? Yeah. Okay. Bloodsport's like on my guilty pleasure films. <laughs> uh, so Kung Fu Shadow sounds delightful. Yeah, this was, don't, this was terrible. This was the best idea we've ever had. This was miserable. Give me you those have things. 15 films I that you can watch and review for the aristocrats. You're taking these home. No, these are all gems. I don't have a way to watch DVDs. That's so. frightening. Uh, so anyway, early November, we will be launching the aristocrats. Uh, we're yeah. going to do full movie reviews, hopefully a lot of other things. Uh, and we will have a bigger cast with us. Uh, probably a revolving cast, because basically anybody who wants to really help out, as long as they want to do the work and do the research, we're going to say, hey, come by, shoot your opinion. The staples will be Matt and Josh. Do you know their Twitters? Uh, yes. Matt is at my at Matt right now. Uh, and that, we'll link it down below, because okay. his name is Matt Wright. It's spelled different. And Josh is at Josh the underscore the underscore meat. Josh yeah. the meat. Uh, that is Josh Adamak. Both of these gentlemen can be seen in our... Uh, interview with a dominatrix video video yes uh, so if you like that and their delightful sense of humor they're going to be joining us on the aristocrats in early november i uh, and we hope you will be too so go ahead and if you want i'm not going to try to force you with these films how could you not want yeah if you've made it this far in this video <laughs> you are of the mind that yeah okay uh in the link below we will have uh our twitter and the channel for the aristocrats that you can go ahead and subscribe to and follow if you'd like.